hello guys welcome to another video here on the channel um i'm gonna do two videos today two separate videos um and it's gonna be uh football match reviews um so today we've got the big game um it's <laughs> loot in town entertaining blackpool obviously as a local blackpool lad obviously i'm just gonna throw a review and predictions obviously Liverpool, um blackpool should i say have come off on a really bad result um, a couple of bad results actually, but in particular a 3-1 defeat to Cardiff. I was at that game I mean, if you haven't already checked the vlog go and check it out um, Brilliant brilliant um, day out um, on a Easter Friday um, But it was a bad result a bad performance um, That cost Mick McCarthy his job 14 days in charge 14 games in charge, sorry um, and um, Yeah, he's left Blackpool now, Stephen Dobby is currently in charge as caretaker to the end of the season. Now, can he present some pride into the team? It's going to be interesting what his uh, his team selection is going to be. Um, so I'll keep an eye on that about half two. I'll post a video the, once we know the team news. Um, I'll post a little short video just showing people the, the team news. So, obviously, Luton are flying high. They are chasing Sheffield United down like, like no tomorrow. They want that second. They want Premier League football. They want automatic football on Premier League. Um, you know, it's it's tight down there. You know, you got Middlesbrough down in the, those playoff places. You got Millwall not out of it. So if, if Blackpool pulled up an absolute upset today, you never know. You know, a, a temporary manager in charge sometimes allows that to happen. Um, a new gaffer confidence. Obviously, hopefully these boosts come, but I, I don't see anything but a losing win, to be honest, guys. As much as I want Blackpool to get the result, I take a point. Um, I think that's the best result Blackpool could hope for today, maybe a draw. But Blackpool could surprise us all, and, you know, they tend to show up against these big teams, don't they? You know, the 3-3 draw against Burnley, um, and then obviously the 0-0 against Burnley. Um, but I'm going to go for a narrow Luton Town win today. Um, so I'm going to go for a 1-0 loot in town or a 2-1. I do think Blackpool will play well and I, I do believe, you know, Blackpool are out of it. Uh, I don't think Blackpool will stay up unless Cardiff and Huddersfield go on a losing streak and Blackpool go on a winning streak. Now, after this game, Blackpool have actually got some winnable games. They've got Wigan at home, they've got Millwall at home, which I do believe they could beat Millwall, and they've got West Brom at home. Those, all those three home games I'm hoping to get to, if not, definitely the, the two of them, um, to check finances and stuff like that. But I'm hoping Jerry Yates is back in the team today because I think that will help Blackpool if they're going to try and get a result. Like I said, there could be a shock result on the cards today and Blackpool could end up getting, you know, a 1-0 win or, or even a 1-1 draw or a 0-0 draw. Um, I think if Luton score first, that's when it's going to be hard for Blackpool. Now, if Blackpool get the first goal, it could be interesting what's going to happen. Now, you can watch it on Sky if you've got Sky, if you've got the red button. Um, it's on Sky Sports Football, red button, um, because they're showing the um, Coventry versus Bristol City game, um, but you, I mean Watford game, sorry. Um, so you could, you can go on there and, um, you know, just click on the red button, you can watch it. Um, but yeah, hopefully, hopefully I'm wrong and hopefully Blackpool do get a result, but I'm just being real, realistic, realistic, and obviously people can have opinions, but my opinion is I, I, I don't see this being a winnable game for us. Um, I think, you know, the confidence is not there. Yes, we've got a new manager and I think the performance will improve. I think we'll play really well and I don't think Luton will smash Blackpool as of what people are making out. People are thinking Blackpool are going to lose 5-0, 6-0, 4-0. I think it'll be a lot tighter than that. I think it'll either be a narrow 1-0 win or a 2-1 win. I do think Blackpool will score and I do think Blackpool will somehow try and scrape a result. Um, but I just don't see it. Um, I just see a, what I see out of this is a very good performance out of Blackpool going into the games that they need to win. Now, mathematically, they can still stay up. They're not relegated. It's that mathematically they can still do it. Cardiff have that game in hand, which is very key. If they lose that, I know Cardiff got a, f a few hard games coming up as well. They got Burnley, and I think Sheffield United, something like that. And I think they got Middlesbrough as well. I'm not too sure. Um, and then Huddersfield today got Blackburn. Obviously, I don't really like Blackburn because obviously being a Lancashire team. But I'm going to rule Blackburn on today 
because obviously if 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 Blackpool can get a result beat Huddersfield today that helps Blackpool a little bit you know but ultimately it's not in Blackpool's hands is it for, for surviving um, a lot of fans I speak to always already think they're in League One um, I still have hope that they will stay up mathematically they still can so when the team news is out guys I will post a separate video um, thanks for watching guys let's hopefully we can get a result